Hey, what's going on everybody? It's ETA Prime back here again. Today's video is a little bit different because I'm in front of the camera and this is really freaking me out, guys. So bear with me here. In the last three or four months, I've had several people contact me and ask me how they could help my channel out if they can donate. Now, I'm not begging for money, but I had an idea. Since so many people have been asking me about this, I've set up a PayPal down below in the description. You can click on it. What we're going to do is raise enough money to build a straight emulation PC. Now, I already have a 270X video card with 2 gigabytes of RAM and a 1 terabyte Western Digital Blue hard drive that we're going to use in the unit. I have set up two different configurations that we could choose from. So I want you guys to go down in the comments and either choose the AMD or the Intel. What I'll do is go down there, find uh, you know how many people wanted AMD, how many people wanted Intel, and we'll build that. So I would foot the whole bill myself, but the problem is this month I have to build an editing PC. In the back here I have an old 990 Optiplex. I run Linux, Mac, and Windows on this machine. I do all of my work on this machine. It works great, but I need another machine because usually I'll record on Windows. I'll have to reboot, transfer my video that I recorded over to the other hard drive that's running Mac and edit it in Final Cut there. It's a big hassle. Sometimes editing takes up to two to three hours for a, a, a one and a half gigabyte video. I mean, it's crazy. So this month I have to invest in a new build. I'm gonna do a i7 build I don't know if I'm going to go Skylark or not, but I've been saving up for a 3D printer for a long time, and now that money has to go into another PC. It's going to be worth it. I'll be able to edit out videos faster. I'll have more gameplay videos and things like that. So if you guys do want to help out with this emulation PC, do not feel obligated. You do not have to. If you're mad that I'm making a video about this, don't be, because this is for people who have already asked me if they could donate. And I've had tons of people ask me, and I said, no, I don't have anything. Don't, don't. You know, I don't want money. I would like to put everything that I make from my YouTube channel, be it ad revenue, donations, or anything, back into the channel. So, with all that said, let's go over to the PC and check out these two builds. We have a Athlon X4 build, which is ah, uh, so and so, and then we have a 6100 i3 build. We're going to move over there now. So here's the two builds I've come up with. On the left here, we have the i3 build coming in at $300. Over here on the right, we have the AMD build, which is only $180. So if you notice, we don't have a hard drive, operating system, or a video card listed here. I have a one terabyte Western Digital Blue hard drive, a 270X two gigabyte video card, and a 60 gigabyte SSD we can throw in here to put the operating system on. The i3 setup has an i3-6100, an ECS motherboard. I know ECS isn't the best of the best, but it's a very cheap motherboard. It's pretty much the cheapest I could find. 8 gigabytes of DDR4 RAM, 430 watt power supply because the case doesn't come with a power supply. We'll be using a mini ITX motherboard. And the Cougar QBX case. This is a beautiful case. I mean, it is very streamlined, very tiny little case. Everything should fit very nicely inside of there. So that comes out to 300 bucks, and uh, shipping's not added in there, but that's no problem. Shouldn't be more than 20 bucks to ship. Over here, we have the AMD build. It'll have an AMD Athlon X4, 860K, eight gigabytes of DDR3 RAM, again, an ECS motherboard, and an Apex TX381 Black Steel Micro ATX case. Comes with a 300 watt power supply. Should be fine for the 270 we're going to throw in it. If not, I can find one around. My buddy's probably got an extra 430 watt somewhere. So let me know in the comments which one you guys want to build. Like I said, if I don't get any donations at all for the build, no problem. It's going to take me two months, 60 days, and I'll have one of these built. If I have to foot the bill myself, I'm going to go with the Intel build most definitely. I believe in Intel and that little i3 will mop the floor with that Athlon. Now there's some benchmarks rolling around where the Athlon does kill the i3, but in real world performance, that i3 is plenty for what we need. We'll be able to run anything from Commodore all the way up to the Wii at probably 4K resolutions. Not bad for 300 bucks. Both of these builds are fairly cheap, but we don't have a hard drive or video card listed in any of these builds. I already have that that we can throw in there. For our operating system, we're going to run Windows 10 and we're going to run LaunchBox on Windows 10. LaunchBox is amazing. I have a full access to LaunchBox, a lifetime membership. 
we're going to pretty much use big box so every emulator can be integrated into big box and it looks amazing i mean we'll go into it real quick and i'll just show you So right now I haven't set it up completely. I just got it like two days ago. I haven't had much time to mess with it, but we have N64, GameCube, Super Nintendo. So if we go into, let's say, Nintendo 64, we have all of our games listed here. Really awesome. And right now on this PC we're using, it's a 270X 2 gigabyte card, and it runs everything at full speed, no trouble at all. So again, if you guys want to donate, you can. If not, don't worry about it. I completely understand. By the end of this month, I'll have a new rig, so I'll be able to put out more videos quickly because I'll be able to render my stuff out a lot quicker. And the last thing is, uh, if you do donate, I will make a video giving you a shout out. I can shout out your YouTube channel, your name, whatever you'd like. If you want to stay anonymous, that's completely okay with me. I also thought about possibly having airbrushed names inside of the case, but this Cougar doesn't allow for much room at all. If you have any ideas about that, let me know in the comments below. I appreciate you guys watching. If you could, hit that like button, subscribe, and like always, thanks for watching.